Hello, welcome to this listing. The item that I want to show you now is a, a very nice antique Japanese Buddhist temple altar bell and a bell stand, cushion, and striker. Let's talk about the bell first. When we, when we received this bell, it didn't have any accessories. There was no stand, striker, or cushion. And uh, though we were very impressed with the bell and the t sound that it produces, we wanted to go ahead and try to uh, complete the set. So we took the bell down to our local Buddhist altar goods store and had the owner uh, select an appropriate cushion, stand, and striker to go with this bell. Uh, let's go ahead and talk about the bell first and then we'll uh, see about the other items. This particular bell has a, a beautiful uh, dark patina, uh, suggestive of uh, being in a, uh, an altar situation for many years. It probably dates from uh, the middle of the 20th century, maybe even before World War II. The bell is in very good condition. It has uh, no cracks or uh, large dents, although it does have some scratches and marks from handling, as well as the darkened patina that you can see. In addition to the bell, we have a uh, brand new cushion. This cushion is uh, specifically sized for this bell, and you can see that when the bell fits within the cushion, there is a nice overlap here, and that's the appropriate size overlap for this size bell. This allows the convex base of the bell to fit nicely within the cushion, and this improves the uh, overall quality of the sound. There's also a uh, wooden base that the cushion then sits upon. Now the base is um, vintage as well, and it actually did come to us with the bell, although we're not sure if it actually was originally associated with the bell, we suspect that might have been the case. The base is uh, made of solid wood with a, a nice lacquer finish, and it has some uh, decorative elements that uh, you can see here. You can see these decorative pieces in greater detail if you look on the listing photos. And finally, there's a, a wooden striker with a uh, fabric, cush fabric uh, cover at the end. All right, let's go ahead and hear this lovely bell. Now we've, in this business, we have the opportunity to uh, see and uh, listen to many uh, Japanese altar bells. And I must confess that uh, the sound that is produced by this particular bell is one of the nicest and loveliest sounds we've heard in a while. So I hope that that uh, tone will come across nicely in the camera. Let's go ahead and ring it. I'll ring it several times. I hope that you can hear the resonance uh, that this bell has. It's a very lovely tone. So if you're looking for a, a vintage Japanese uh, bell for use with either a Butsudan altar or in a small temple setting, then we'll hope you'll uh, consider these items. Please uh, give us a call or send us an email if you have any questions. We're always happy to hear from you. Thanks a lot for visiting. Bye-bye.